What is up YouTube, Computer MD of Gilbert here, and today I'm going to address another pretty popular question I've gotten recently. Uh, the question is how to add and maximize and customize a photo gallery in Wix. Well, thankfully Wix has just added another pretty sweet app that helps you do this. This is also great for photographers so if there's any photographers watching that are starting a website this is great for you I have another video coming with another great photography website app idea so here we go we're gonna go over to the app market once we get to the app market we're gonna add Wix Pro Gallery once we add that we're gonna go click settings again that was Wix Pro Gallery um, and you could type that in the search bar for its headlining just click it and then we'll go to settings once we get into settings you're gonna see main we'll get to manage media in a second but let's get that layout done so first the layout you choose how you want your pictures to be arranged that could either be vertical horizontal masonry column grid however you want you have full customization over this you could choose the thumbnail size the spacing between the pictures um, you could choose the collage density and then moving on we have the settings so you can choose to open and expand which means when you click on it it expands or you a link opens or nothing happens at all um, so again you go through these settings customize them as you need them uh, you could choose to have the social sharing options on there so all your social media um, download means that if you click that open you'll see your visitors will be able to download only your original photos but not any free Wix images so these images right here are Wix free images people would not be able to download these however if you have this download checked people can download your pictures so if you're selling your pictures or you don't want people to have access to these unless they buy them please do not check this button because you will not be happy that you did especially if you're a photographer who's going to be selling their album to the person that you just took pictures of you don't want them to go download all of them before they buy it so don't check that if that's what you're doing if not go ahead and check it if you want people to just have those free images uh, again you could have a heart icon people like the picture Moving on, we have our design. You could choose the color overlay, the title, and you could choose the, like the hover mode. You could preview it. Moving into the advanced settings, this is more of like your image detailing. So your image quality, the sharpening. You could see, sh whoops, sharpen all of your photos in the gallery using the amount, radius, and threshold controls. You could choose that again. All customization to you. And then finally, video settings. So you could choose if you have a video in your gallery, whether it plays on a loop, how it plays, the playback speed, all of that stuff. So it's all really cool. And then finally, support. This is just Wix's last little part for them because, as I said, this is a new app, so they want reviews. And if you need any Wix support directly, you could contact them or gallery help. Now, last part of this, obviously, is uploading your pictures. So you would go here to manage media. When you do that, you'll be in your gallery. And in here, you could add media by simply clicking add media. You could choose whether it's an image, video, or text. Once you do that, it will pop up and populate into this little section. And then as you can see over here, once you click on one, you could change the title, you could add a description, you could add a link to it. So if people click the picture, it takes them to a different page or a different website or however you're doing that. Uh, you could replace the image, um, which I would assume for like photography and stuff, you wouldn't do that. But if you had a video and you wanted a thumbnail on there, you could replace the image which is pretty cool in here you have your settings and then simply you could select all and you could delete them all at once or you could deselect and that's simply how you use Wix Pro Gallery the nice thing about this is that it's completely customized to you so however you want to customize it to your needs that's how you do it um, and I know I've gotten a lot of questions about customization in galleries on Wix lately. So Wix has released this. Again, it's Wix Pro Gallery. If this video helped you out, please drop me a like down below. It's much appreciated. Please subscribe to me if you haven't already because we have a ton of more exciting Wix content coming up. And finally, comment if you have any questions on this or any Wix questions in general. And I'm here to help you out. 
Guys, thank you for spending a couple minutes of your time watching this video with me. Uh, I appreciate that, and I will catch you on the next one.